real, very awesome um, conversation that I've just had with my son. Right? I'm talking about the brain, how the human brain works, and how that new thoughts um, are created. That new thoughts come from the memories that are already there. Right? So within the stories, within your memories, right? Um, thoughts come from different places within the brain, right? And they join together and they make a new pathway, right? Uh, and the, the more emotional the um, memories, right? The more emotion uh, in there, then the stronger this memory that's created. So we were talking about how a new original um, thoughts, how do you unlock um, new areas of the brain, come up with the original, because, you know, anybody who's lived long enough to hear a decent amount of music, films, right, just remakes of things, things get sort of um, remixes, you yeah. know. Um, so what about originality, right, unlocking new thoughts? Okay, so here's how the brain works in a in a really simple or technical sense. All right, so we're told that we you know use ten percent. It's really a good calculable figure, right? So ten percent. So we've got. Ten layers of ten, right? Hundred percent, right? And this is where the 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 three layers, right? The the reptilian, which is sort of prehistoric, basic um, reactions, your instincts, right? And we'll put this at a base level, and then you've got the higher um, intelligence, right? We'll put this up here, and this is the middle sort of ground, right? Um, so what happens is, so you use 10%. Now, we know this through sort of like MRI scans and scanning that, you know, signals and sort of reactions come from different parts um, of the brain, different areas of the brain, all right? So there'll be 1% there, 1% there, 1% there, and there we go, all right? All you gamers all be saying, oh, it looks a bit like a, you know, um, level of Donkey Kong. Well, there's a clue. All right. And so what happens is, this is sort of an average, all right? It fires off in all different areas of the brain. To unlock new areas, or when new areas are unlocked, because there is ways to unlock new areas of the brain, right? What happens is, right, is when you get efficient and you are using the capacity, right, and you're using the 10% well, right, another 1% might open up there, right? And maybe one there. Uh, so it opens up different areas of the brain. So they're trying to map out, trying to figure out how to do all this because what actually this represents in a inside, outside, cosmic, you know, um, sort of way um, is these represent the rooms within the brain where the light's been switched off that you can use, that you, that you see, that you know, right? Um, and they want to call that light matter until they figured out dark matter. And just called it matter, right? It mat matters. Um, so this is light matter and this space um, within the brain that's not been um, opened up, the light's not been switched on, right? Is dark matter. That's what I represent. Right? Um, so yeah. There we go. 
simple explanation and like I said there are new ways um, to unlock or to turn the light on right, in different rooms within the brain right, um, to access the information that's there because going from you know basic instincts right, to a, a higher power sort of godly creator of the universe type thing uh, shouldn't just <laughs> happen at the flick of one switch right? um, that's why you have to map it out and you have to learn the map which is the map of yourself and where you are and these and all the layers of it there you go yeah. very interesting conversation uh, so I'll share that out with the layers and the rooms within your brain, this is, you know, um, where we store things and access memories. Showing you in a, in a flat sort of background, which really you want that sort of like minority report, Tony Stark type, you know, um, to, to do it more. But that's a simple sort of Donkey Kong 